in this video I'm going to do an example on graphs and application of graphs so let's read the question okay uh, over a 12 month period the retail price of an LCD TV is noted the model that best dis represents the price over this period is by this equation C which is the cost in dollars is minus 4 times m minus 5 squared plus 1200 where m is the number of months okay so m stands for the month you can see the graph here and this is the equation of this graph okay so this is the parabola okay so let's read the first question what is the release what is the special release price of the lcd tv now this is month zero okay so this is a month zero and say this is say probably if you join this point this is over a period of 12 months this graph is only for a period of 12 months so basically this question is asking you what's the price when m is zero okay so this is the release price so by looking at the equation i can say when m is zero if you put so what they're asking is so let us do it mathematically we can do we don't need to do this but just to explain so they're asking us what C, what is C when M is zero. So C in dollars would be if you put zero here, so that is minus four times zero minus pi squared plus twelve hundred. Okay, it's good that I did it. I thought it would be zero. So this is let me bring this down a little. Oh sorry. So how to use try to finish this off. So this is minus four times twenty-five because minus five squared is twenty-five plus twelve hundred. And twenty-five times minus four is hundred. So this is twelve hundred minus one one hundred. So this is one thousand one hundred. So the release price is one thousand. So I'll write this the release prices so this I'll write it down yeah, I'll write here so the release prices 1100 so this on the graph is 1100 I'll show this how to draw this on a calculator and check it so if you get your calculators out so if you have a graphic calculator go to table menu so let me show let me see the equation so go to your table menu and type in this equation minus 4 times uh, instead of m you can type in x minus 5 squared plus 1200 just like that so this is this equation m has been replaced by x okay and then you have to set from 0 m is 0 to 12 and step is this is uh, the x values will go from 1 to 12 uh, in one in a step of 1. So I'll explain what that means. You go to table. So this is when m is 0, you started at 1100. That's what we got. Okay, so if you scroll up, scroll down, you can see the prices. This is where something very interesting happened. Okay, I'll come to that later. Okay, <coughs> so for the second question, so this answer is, for this, our answer is 1,100. So that's our first answer. Okay, what is the maximum retail price of the LCD TV over the 12-month period? And when and what month does this occur? So let me bring the calculator back. So in month four, in month four the price is 1,196. In the fifth month, it is 1,200. Okay, and in the sixth month, it's again 1,196. So can you see a pattern there? So this is, in other words, from looking at this table, this is the answer. In the fifth month, this is the maximum price, but we'll have to confirm that. So what they're asking is, uh, the maximum price is, uh, from the calculator, from the table menu, you can say, in the fifth month, in the fifth month, you got the maximum price of, 1200 okay 
$1,200. So I'll show this on a, in a graphical way. So if you go to graph, and you got that equation, so I have to scroll this up like this. So maximum we saw is 1200, so I'll go, you have to change the scale, so you go shift, F3 will give you this window, it's called view window. Okay, so your X I want, which is our month, from 0 to 12, scale of 1, don't do anything in dot, so I'll go from 0 to, say, 1500, 0 to 1500, scale of 500, and see what the graph looks like. So this is your graph from 0 to 12. So we can find the answer in the graph menu by going GSOL, and the maximum is, this point is called the maximum. So you press F2, so in the fifth month you got 1200, so that's right. So graphically, what does that mean? This means, this is say, this is the twelfth month, so somewhere this is not drawn to scale. The fifth month, somewhere here, this is, you reach the maximum price of $1,200 just like that okay now the next question is after how many months is the price of LCD retailing for 1056 okay so 1056 the question is when C is 1056 what is M is the question so here again I'll use I'll first use the calculator and then show you so this is a graph the question is you want to find C you want to find M, which is X, when Y, or your C, is 1056. Again, go to GSOL, and then you press F6, and then you press F2, which is X calc. X corresponds to your the month, so F2. And they're asking you, what's your Y value, which is your C, which is 1056. I'll show you this, how to do it algebraically. So in the 11th month, you got the price of? 1056 can we okay so there's only one in this uh, interval so you can see in the 11th month there was a price of 1056 now how to do this algebraically so let me change color I'll do the working here so I'll put one so the equation is C is equal to minus 4 times M minus 5 squared plus 1200 so I have to put 1056 here, so 1056 is minus 4 times m minus 5 squared plus 1200. So if you take away 1200 from both sides, so 1056 minus 1200 is equal to minus 4 times m minus 5 squared. So let me use the calculator. So menu run, so 1056 minus... 1200 gives me 1 minus 144 so this is I don't have space here I'll try to finish it here so can I write here minus 144 is equal to minus 4 times m minus 5 squared so if you divide this side by negative 4 I can also divide this side by negative 4 so I'll go minus sorry minus 144 divide by negative 4 that gives me 36 so I will try to finish in this space so let me change the green color so can I write here let me scroll this down I can scroll this down oh, can't scroll it down so uh, 1000 I can write let me box it out so I'll show the working here so can I say what was the answer 36 so can I say 36 is equal to for excellence you have to show the working m minus 5 squared okay so that's how I got 36 so if you take square root of 36 you can take square root of m minus 5 squared m minus 5 squared square root of 36 is 6 so this is m minus 5 and if you add 5 to both sides so 6 plus 5 is equal to m that's how we got m is equal to 11 okay now the last question is where you have to make some statements okay make two valid statements 
justify the fluctuation in the price of LCD TV over 12 month period be specific in giving supporting information so first is it started with 1100 it peaked at 1200 and after 12 months so let me see let me go back to my table okay our graph will do oh, hold on so let me go to a table and type in the equation which is already there and uh, and see what happens after 12 months if you go down to so it's going down so it started at it started at 1100 okay so it started at 1100 it reached the peak after five months okay then the prices are going down okay so after 12 months it went even below the initial price okay or the offer price what what do they call that uh, over so the first question was release price so it's going below the release price so what can be the maths behind it so why is what's the reason of fluctuation so initially that was an offer price so i'm not going to write it so i'm only going to say it so initially the price was so you can say when zero was the pro, uh, in m, when m is zero it started at 1100 so after five months the price peaked to 1200 and say after then it started going down when, when it was say 12 months the price is uh, 1004 so basically what's happening is initially they are they are giving an offer okay making it attractive people are interested in the product so people start buying it so the price goes up and as the price goes up they it reaches a peak and then the demand for the product decreases and then the price comes down the reason the price comes down is probably there was some other tv other model of tv that came in the market which made this less attractive so prices are dependent on demand and supply so and also the new technology so the new technology probably uh, took over this lcd technology so and that's the reason the prices went down so after 12 months it even went down below the offer price or which was the initial special release price okay so here that's what happens in technologies see you in the next video